I'm Jonathan Milam, and I'd like to spend a moment with you discussing trumpet cases today. First thing I wanted to say is I've got a great ProTech. I think they call this their deluxe triple bag, and uh, it's a nice one. But uh, when carrying trumpets around, if your case does not have specific slots that will hold mouthpieces, you really need to be careful. I've seen some great horns that have got a lot of bell damage by mouthpieces rolling around. Very cheap to pick up something like this by Bach. It's just a little uh, plastic flex piece that will uh, take a mouthpiece very easily. Um, and then uh, you've got, of course, doubles. This is by Yamaha. Just a simple little case that holds a double Velcro's the top across. This is great. It's a little leather piece by Guard. Zips down and you can take the mouthpiece out of it. But uh, then what this does, it attaches on the outside of the case. It's got a little uh, uh, portion here with the uh, part that makes it easy to lock onto the case, or you could lock it on the inside if you wanted. But uh, you really want to be sure that your mouthpieces, in some of these cases where there's not specific slots for them, don't get loose and destroy a good horn. This is the case that I use most often when I'm traveling, and um, I'll tell you why. It's a nice Protec case. Uh, this lists for about $190 in a uh, heavy, I probably call it ballistic, uh, denier nylon of some sort. But uh, I got this one used leather for $100, uh, $25 for shipping, so $125 total. Great case. You see it's got a flap on the outside, it's got another flap on the other side, slightly smaller. It's got an uh, area here that will open up that you can carry probably sheet music. I've got four pins here. It's got a lot of zippered areas. Uh, very, very nice setup. I think uh, got a spare phone charger here. On the other side, we've got a mute bag, which is just a little attachment here, and it will easily carry, I think they say four mutes, but uh, realistically, I've got three, uh, four, um, five, and make that an even six that we had in the mute bag. Now this is a bag, so it's not quite as sturdy as a uh, trumpet case, but nonetheless, very convenient. And one thing I do like about this, I don't use mutes very often. So uh, the mute part is you can just take it off and um, get your mutes and move them all out of the way and then you're in good shape to go. Uh, for me, I believe, I believe, and my memory sometimes is less than stellar, I believe I've carried a flugelhorn, a cornet, and a trumpet in this, but I would not want to do that often. And if you're going to do that with a bag which is not hard-sided like some trumpet cases, you're really going to be sure that you're not going to bang the thing up. Um, but in this, uh, quite easily, I've got a cornet and to be flat trumpets, you know, full size. My newest horn here, which is an F. Besson Miha by Canstall, and I should be doing a review on that maybe later today. And of course, the trustworthy old box strap. And uh, what I like about this is it does have a piece inside that's uh, padded that you can set the cornet in and the trombone on either side. Or if you chose, you could put a flugel in here. I know you could do that easily if it's small bell. And a trumpet in the other side probably might not want to try the cornet, although I believe I have. But what I usually do is take the liner out. And the reason I use this so much is when I'm traveling, it's a nice looking leather case. I can keep material in here if I need some uh, supplies of some sort or other. The mute case, I've carried my toiletries in, a little shampoo, shaving cream, so on and so forth. Then you've got this hollowed exterior. And what I'll do is I'll load some clothes in here, a pair of jeans, uh, uh, undergarments, then I'll set the horn on top of that, and then I'll repack socks or whatever you got, shirts on top of that so that the horn is cocooned. And uh, when I go on vacation, usually I'll take this bag and I'll take a cornet with me so I can get some mouthpiece time and actually work on a horn. And, uh, you know, it doesn't take an extra case or anything like that. Great case. I really do like the ProTec, and especially in leather. And as I mentioned, I got it used for 100 bucks. It's an extraordinary price, but uh, this is what I use most of the time. 
I think one of the more popular cases now that's uh, very available, and I know I've sold them on um, eBay, and so they certainly are available there, is the Yamaha Double. And uh, one reason, in fact, two reasons that I like this is because it's an extremely light case. It is hard-sided, but it is very, very light and um, easily holds two horns. If you're going to use uh, a stand, you'll want to use an in-the-bell stand model, and it has two mouthpiece spots, and then it does have four slots for additional implements like um, valve oil, uh, things of that nature. However, they are quite small, so you're a little bit challenged there what you can do, but it is a nice case, extremely light, and um, really, uh, these are very popular, probably because they're so light and they'll easily carry two trumpets. My most recent acquisition that I'm really proud of, actually haven't had it out of the house yet, is a Torpedo Classic, and uh, I really like this. Hard, hard tubing, I think they use it for plumbing probably, those big white pieces that are probably uh, eight inches or so. Then they put uh, ballistic denier nylon, I believe is what they put on the outside. Now I've got the single back strap holding everything in case and tight because I really like a small case. But um, what you've got here is actually a marvelous setup. You've got a music holder here, it'll unzip and then you can place music in. You actually have two very nice back straps that are held in place by the music holder. And then here, again, you've got your mute bag, which I've got some uh, music supplies, a snake, a mouthpiece cleaner, but uh, easily get some nice mutes in here. And believe me, this is a, a very good, good setup. And so that's what you're gonna be looking like, you know, if you're using the mute case and it's fully extended. Uh, great handle here, as we mentioned. It's got the side strap. If you just want to strap it over uh, one shoulder and off you go. But the nice thing about this is the complete protection that you get. With your trumpet, you're going to take the trumpet and you're just going to place it inside the well padded area. Here you've got the top that zips off so that you can carry mouthpieces. And I've got a uh, stick in there with some uh, songs on it. And when you get this thing all good to go, it is just about as impervious to damage as you get. If you're gonna check a horn, of course you've got the Walt Johnson case uh, that's extremely substantial. But this is such a nice little tight case, just a little bigger than the trumpet. Great way to go. So we've got the Protect Deluxe gig bag and uh, the Yamaha Double and the Torpedo Classic. These are great cases. You've got a two and a half and a single and a double. Can't imagine that you'd need a whole lot more than that. Thanks for joining me. Check out the other videos and have a great day.